come on dad sing your song what do you do if you don't, don't want, want money what do you want if you don't want gold <laughs> wish <laughs> you wanted my love I may huh. go ahead lad <laughs> yeah. you're gonna ride home on your motorbike yeah go ahead then there's a blue one for you seeing as you're an Avertonian down on Eastern Ferry today, all the bikers. <laughs> nice bikes. Lovely little blue cars. Yeah. Cool. That's a Yamaha, that. This one's a Moto Guzzi. And uh, I don't know what that is, probably a BMW. Cool. What do you do if you don't want money? What do you do if you don't want gold? Don't you want my love, baby? Kawasaki, yeah. Dad, would you like this one? Yeah. You gonna drive home or not? Yeah. All right, Stephen, you can you can uh, you can get the ferry home, mate. Uh, a bit windy today, but yeah, some nice bikes here. Lovely Indian. I don't know whether they make modern ones, but it's like old modern, isn't it? Sure. There you go. It's like train spotting, isn't it? What do you do? Do you want if you don't want money? Go ahead. What do you want if you don't want gold? Wish you wanted my love, baby. Happy days, Dad. Thanks very much. Bye bye. You know that air shot screen. That's been out of me. Loved it. Because by the time we got all ends up, that health and safety things. It's too late to go ahead of it. Here you go. On the Harley Davidsons. What do you want if you don't want money? What do you want if you don't want gold? Wish you wanted my love, baby. baby. These are just going digging with, with, with Anglo Celtic. Anglo Celtic. You puffs. You puffs. Happy days, kids. <laughs> We've captured two, two prisoners of war here from Czechoslovakia. Yeah. They're coming digging with us. They're coming digging. <laughs> I'm just going digging with Anglo Celtic. You puffs. <laughs> Just going digging with Anglo Celtic. You puffs. Right, Des was telling me one of his farmers' sayings. Go ahead, Des. It works as well. Right. Ash for a splash and oak for a soak. If the oak tree's out with leaves before the ash tree, it means it's going to be a wet summer. But if the ash tree's out before the oak tree, it means it's going to be a nice hot summer. One more quick one before we go. You got any more? No. <laughs> you liar. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me, mother? <laughs> Line's gone dead. Cool mobile you got there, mate. Is that one of the knock new Nocta ones or what? You new Nocta Silver. <laughs> Silver three pence. Yellow Specs of Destiny. Silver three pence. So wait. God knows kids, don't ask, just don't ask, I don't want to know, don't ask me to explain. I thought we were going detecting, are we there yet? Oh. What's this now? Nick Ami, what have you done to me, what have you done to me bloody car? I mean just sense of reason, I'm just, I'm just, even for me, my mind's boggled. Oh, he's telling me the name of the village now, thanks. Bit fucking late, isn't it? Hey, now I won't tell you again. Get to bed. And now the end is near. I've lived my life, of which I'm certain. You puff, I'm not a queer. I'll state my case. 
of which I'm certain regrets oh, I've had a few but then again to future mansion hello kids this is uh, Anglo-Celtic uh, of uh, the Saxon ring piece finders the golden finkter now I just thought I'd have a little chat you know because uh, some of you don't actually really know much about what I've been doing. You might have had a little glimpse at a video of mine. Well, I was just a guy who had like no Roman coins or hammies, nothing. My first online experience of metal detecting was a right uppity online forum that's still going. Kicked me out of their Facebook group the other week without even telling me. That's what you're up against, you see. So, um, I didn't like their forum. We had a big discussion about how I could move forward in the hobby, getting people out on the land. A lot of people in that forum said, you, you're on drugs, you. What do you mean? You can't just take willy-nilly random people out on your land. Well, I, I knew that because I didn't actually have any land at the time. <laughs> but, yeah, I, uh, I left that forum. I started my Facebook groups. Uh, they've been going for over two years now. I've now actually got three. I've got my baby. I've got my baba. It's a uh, friendly metal detector in Great Britain and overseas on Facebook. Um, I've got my silver finds metal detector on Facebook. It says it does what it says on the tin. It's a silver tin for silver finds. And I've got metal detecting and prospecting in Europe. A shed. I've got metal detecting and prospecting in Europe. And between them three groups of mine, I've got about 4,000 people in them. Thereabouts. And uh, I just enjoy getting people out me. I love making me videos. Uh, mad as a box of frogs and all that, you know. Been getting a lot of stick lately because I've got a free machine. Hey, hey, nothing in life is free. I had to make six videos for the manufacturer's website. And I had to follow a long list of rules. And do you know what I mean? It's just sour grapes, isn't it? Hey, I've, I've actually been in charge of a whip round that got about four or five machines to lads who, who, who didn't have the money for them. So I've put five machines out there with the help of my members. I get one and give the manufacturer six good videos. But I'm a scav, am I? Hey, hey, I ain't no scav, lad. Um, as for what else, I'm a vile, vile human being. What, because I sold loads of metal detectors for you and I didn't kiss your bum? Sorry, mate. No, Stevie you're talking to. Born and bred in Birkenhead, mate. I can read your mind like a magazine. I know where you're at. I see where you've been. Sorry, but yeah, there you go. Anyway, it's going really great now. I've got sponsorship of a kind. Um, I'll be testing machines for certain manufacturers. And I will be attending lots of rallies that my very good friends put on. See, the, the people who troll me, they might f even find better fans than me. And they might have more followers than me. But I'll tell you all this now, trollers, happy trollers. It's a marathon. It ain't a sprint. Stevie's going to be in this for a long time. And there's one thing you ain't got, right? You ain't got this. My solid 24 carat connections... With all of guys you're worth knowing in the hobby. You might have connections. And if the good guys. You're probably only just pulling the wool. And you'll get left behind by the good guys. I constantly sort the wheat from the chaff. Um, with thousands of. Uh, you know. Metal detectors. Started off doing it nationally. Boom. I do it internationally now. Shout out to me Dutch posse. Lars Schroes. All my buddies, Marco Ross, um, shout out to Craig Drew, shout out to John Hilton Smith, Carl Buddy Murray, all down in Australia. 
Stevie's on a roll, he's a freight train, always has been. And I'm sorry, but all these trolls are just skittles that'll... Rah, look at my badge there. Rah, I'm a pirate. Rah, I'll knock all them skittles out the way. Because that's what I do. You can't stop a freight train once it's rolling. They'll have to learn to live with me. Rah, rah. There you go. Anyway, it's all good. And uh, took my dad out today. Got him on the yellow specks of destiny. What do you do if you don't want money? What do you do if you don't want gold? Don't you want my love, baby? So it's all positive. I've got some great new farms. Oh, but apparently I'm a night hawker and all that. Yeah, get a life. Get a bloody life or I'll set my pirate scully onto you. Okay? Signing off for friendly metal detecting in Great Britain and overseas. Captain Pugwash. Him, lad on the blooming pirates I'm on the pirates lad I've always been a pirate but now my macro racer too Ah, Jim lad Arr, arr.